Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Karen and I do a lot of cleaning motivation videos. I also do homemaking, gardening and just lifestyle videos in general. So today it is Friday and when my husband comes home we are going to enjoy time out in the garden. We are going to barbecue some and maybe potentially if the weather allows it we're going to enjoy some TV time out in our gazebo. But in order for us to have a relaxing Friday evening, this house needs to be clean and freshened up. Mostly it's here in my kitchen. My bedroom, living room and bathroom just needs a quick sprucing up. But my kitchen, that's where all the mess gets. This is where all the action happens. I mean, we cook many times a day. This is the center of our house. This is where we hang out, eat, just watching TV, having fun. So in order for us to have a relaxing Friday evening, I need to tidy up this kitchen. So it is fruit fly season and I've been so good all of June and half of July. And I managed to keep the fruit flies out of my kitchen. But last week, yeah, it was not a good week. So now my kitchen is full of fruit flies that just loves living here and loves everything in my kitchen, whether it's eatable or not. So we are going to start by emptying the dishwasher, filling it up, then I'm going to remove everything on the counters and the windows, and I'm going to spray this section down and try to kill as many fruit flies as I possibly can. When you've sprayed your kitchen with this chemical, you need to leave for at least 30 minutes before you can come back because it is all in the air and is really not good for you to inhale. So while that is working here in the kitchen, we are going to continue in the bedroom and the bathroom and then we're going to come back to the kitchen and finishing it off. So I hope you're going to enjoy today's video. If you do, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe before you leave or why don't you stay and watch some more videos. Yeah. With no further ado, let's just get starting because I feel like I am procrastinating, which I am. So, yeah, let's start cleaning and get this house ready for weekend. You came along, couldn't look away. Somehow you turned my life completely upside down Since you've been gone, there's no peace of mind A foolish heart and healing thought I would find No matter where I lay my head Another town, another bed Dreaming of you 
gotta keep your feet on the ground You just wanna drink your beer and grab the glass and let it go down We're going down Another tip I have for you is to put the brush you use for washing your dishes in the dishwasher. I try to do this at least once a week. It cleans them up pretty good and dissolves any leftovers or grease on them, which can attract fruit flies. Into each other's eyes. Tired snowflakes are coming down. Collapse into water. taking a break from the kitchen, letting the bug spray do its job, and I'm tidying up in the bedroom and the bathroom. And I'm starting by pulling up all the blinds and opening all the windows, letting some fresh air into my bedroom. In here I don't have a lot to do, I have some clothes to put away, and I need to make my bed. Other than that, I just need to freshen it up a bit. So all that's left is you and me. I can promise you're the only thing I see Hold my hand and hear the words I say Close your eyes and let us fade away Build a secret place for you and me Let our minds be caught up in a dream
But before we continue with the cleaning, I just need to show you the end of my side of the bed. This is where my cat sleeps all night long and all the way until I make my bed. So it is covered in cat hair and even some litter from her. It's a good thing I love my little sweetheart so much. So she does get away with it. The walls are listening when we talk. Making echoes as we walk. But really, it's an easy problem to fix using a clothing roller like this. And by the way, I have also made sure that my cat is trapped here in with me in my bedroom whilst I'm cleaning here and letting the bug spray do its job in the kitchen. Don't worry. Build a secret place for you and me. Let our minds be caught up in a dream. Say 
So this vacuum cleaner, guys, is the worst. It gives the weight a really loud, high-pitched sound. It almost gives me a headache every time I use it. And the bottom attachment isn't the right one, and it's not made for carpets. So as you can see, I struggle a lot using it. I think I need a new vacuum cleaner. What do you think? If you have any good recommendations, please let me know down in the comments below. Now we're moving on to my bathroom and if you saw my last week's video, you know I just washed these carpets in my bathroom. But my sweet cat decided to puke all over this one. So let's clean this one again. So we are now back in the kitchen and I am running out of time. My husband is on his way home so I have to clean really fast to be done by the time he gets home. So I'm starting by wiping everything down here to get rid of the bug spray and any dead flies. Then we're moving on to the rest of the kitchen.
that we've prepared the meat for the barbecue, it's time to head out to the vegetable garden, doing some harvesting of our homegrown produce. And we're starting with our cucumbers. Look at these. They are as big as my hands. And these, we're going to pickle. This is our first time doing this, so we have no idea what we're doing or how is the best way to do it. But you will never learn anything unless you try, so fingers crossed. harvest some rhubarb which I'm going to use for a barbecue cobbler. Yes, you heard me and you will see it later in the video. I'm also doing a rhubarb and strawberry syrup for a sneaky little evening martini and of course some homemade jam. I always have to make my homemade jam whenever I'm harvesting my rhubarb.
understand why you're taking off First you say you love me, now you're breaking it off You had me at a low and then you passed go and collected your greens Easily it seems, oh Tell me, did I do something wrong? Or did you invite someone to this song? Don't wanna start by criticizing you, but since we don't talk, there's nothing left to do. But this won't be my heartache, no. This will be your mistake, oh. Go ahead and run. Go ahead and run, run, run. This will be your mistake, oh. It won't be my heartache, no Go ahead and run Now go ahead and run, run, run Oh, run You were all I'd ever seen So this is it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it and thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it and I hope you had a great weekend and have a lovely new week. Take care guys and I will see you next weekend. Bye!